Built-in furniture takes storage solutions to the next level. It helps you organize your home well and provides a more sophisticated look to the space. Unfortunately, they can be somewhat pricey, but do not worry. We've collected 12 DIY built-in bedroom cabinet transformation projects to help you eliminate clutter while adding more style to your sleeping space. As always, Simp Home curates these recommendations for you. Number 12. A cozy nook to hit the books. Some bedrooms serve double duty. They're not only a comfortable place to hit the sack, but also a perfect area to study or even pull an all-nighter. Thus, you may find a home office in a bedroom. Adding a home office in a bedroom is wise, and if you want to have one, you can try to make this cozy nook. First, you can make this cozy home workstation by repurposing your unused closet. Then, install the desk and cabinets. Make sure they fit perfectly with the dimension of the alcove. Then, apply the same color and trim as the walls and baseboard. This way, the desk, cabinet, and walls look like flowing into one being. Since the nook is not that spacious, consider installing built-in lights like recessed cans. You will also have to install nearby power outlets and phone and data lines. The process should be on your priority list from the early stages of your planning. Number 11. A Modern Farmhouse Bedroom Cabinet Idea The modern farmhouse style offers a timeless charm while maintaining a contemporary look. Therefore, incorporating it into your bedroom can be a terrific idea. The good news is you don't have to make the cabinet and dresser combo from scratch. You can use IKEA Tarva and Section to create it instead. First, you must make the frame using 2x2s to separate the existing closet studs. You'll also need to install the cross supports at the same height as the cabinet and dresser carcass. Next, assemble the dresser. You'll find a huge gap between the dresser and the flooring. Don't worry, you only have to attach a 2x4 in between the front two legs. After that, use 2x2s to construct the left side wall. Then, build and install IKEA section right above the dresser. Finally, install the doors, hardware, and 1x8 tongue and groove boards for the siding. Number 10. Blend your cabinet with the wall. A fitted wardrobe is a good choice for those who love to add a personal touch to their bedroom. It usually stays flush with the wall, creating an ultimate uniformity. Besides, this cabinet design will make the room look more elegant. However, despite the perks a fitted wardrobe offers, it also has drawbacks. Since it stays flush with the wall, it will take time to install compared to its freestanding counterpart. Furthermore, you'll have to spend a lot of money on it. You'll also find it hard to move to a new location because it's stuck to where it is now. Number 9. A built-in cabinet with shelving for a nursery Creating a floor-to-ceiling cabinet that spans the entire length is fascinating. Unfortunately, this idea may not properly work because it can take up more floor space. Therefore, you can opt for this corner built-in cabinet and shelves instead. This wardrobe combines an adjoining, step-down shelving unit to conquer the corner of a nursery. Since the shelving unit is lower than the wardrobe, you can access the small cabinet. This wardrobe features beadboard paneling and cast iron hardware, making it a perfect addition to your modern farmhouse home. Number 8. A built-in side cabinet idea with extra cubby. This built-in cabinet features a small cubby facing the bed, making it a perfect substitute for a side table. The cubby allows you to set down your phone and book instantly without leaving your bed. Ideally, you need to make two of these so they can flank the bed. If you do, make sure you reverse the position of the cubby. This way, you can access it from both sides. Number 7. Add stylish storage with stock cabinets. A stock cabinet is your safe bet if woodworking is not your skill and investing in built-ins is currently impossible. You don't have to make your built-in from scratch. Purchasing ready-made cabinets and tweaking them as you please will do in a pinch. Besides, stock cabinets are inexpensive. You can find these unfinished cabinets at Home Depot, Lowe's, and Menards. However, you need to consider buying them from one location to get a consistent look. Once you have the prefab cabinets, you can explore your creativity because the ideas are limitless. For example, you can try making this bedroom storage by topping the cabinet with a shelving unit. Then, install the trims and paint the sides the same color as the wall for a united look. Number 6. A built-in cabinets idea with extra window bench If your area has no light pollution, this built-in window bench will be an ideal companion for your me time. Begin with getting a multi-purpose stock cabinet. Once you've installed the cabinets, measure the gap between them to create the window bench. After that, get your tools and plywood to make the bench. 
Next, top the cabinets with butcher block countertops. After that, top each cabinet with a bookcase with a glass door. Relevant to a bedroom door, you know that you need more than that to protect your sanity from a nasty odor outside your room, right? Here, we've already published several lovely ideas for our loyal readers on making a small bedroom fresh again. If you haven't checked that out, we highly recommend it. Number 5. Let the cabinets flank your bed. These wardrobes will give your small bedroom a more finished look. As we mentioned, the wardrobes flank the bed, allowing you to jump in and out from both sides. They also come in the same color as the ceiling and trim, making them look united. They also feature the same baseboard, which offers a seamless transition when you look at the wardrobes. When you look up, you'll notice crown molding that eliminates an awkward gap between the ceiling and the cabinet. Number 4. A Contemporary Master Bedroom with Built-in Bookshelves Idea With this idea, you'll acquire two towers of built-in shelving units flanking your bed. For a more luxurious appearance, you can install wall molding. Then, paint the shelving unit the same color as the wall. You'll also need to install crown molding on each shelving unit to give a more finished look. Since you aim for elegance, try installing a copper sconce on each side of the shelving unit. Number 3. A built-in cabinet wall with IKEA packs. This built-in cabinet serves double duty. It offers plenty of space for your clothes, bedding, and footwear. Since the cabinets stand from one corner to the other, it creates a single wall. You only need to install shaker doors that look like wall molding. This way, you can get both storage and decoration simultaneously. Number 2. Turn ready-made dressers into bedroom built-ins The problem you may encounter when trying to turn a ready-made dresser into a built-in one is the size and design incompatibility with the existing furniture or fixtures. If it is not flush well with the walls and the baseboard leaves a gap, to overcome this problem, you only need to cut the baseboard so that the dresser can sit snugly. If you still find any gaps, slip a 1x2 piece of scrap wood and secure it with nails. Finally, install the baseboard to the bottom of the dresser to make it built-in furniture. Before we complete the countdown with our final choice of the current list, we'd like to inform you that if you need other improvement ideas, you have Simphome Content Collections on your side. There, we cover other interesting topics such as garden, home improvement, finance, bathroom upgrade, bedroom update ideas, and many more. We'll see you there, and until we meet again sometime in the future, let's close our countdown with number one, a built-in home office space and cabinet idea. Having a home office is a kind of privilege that you need to be grateful for. This home office features an old secretary desk that has become stylish because of the crisp white paint and new hardware. Then, top it with shelves, add a desk next to it, install baseboard and crown molding, and you're good to go. That's it for now. Before you leave this presentation, we'd like to appreciate every second you spend watching the video. If we deserve more of your attention in the future, press the subscribe button if you haven't done it already. Like the video if you believe it will motivate the YouTube algorithm to push the video to more people. Honestly though, it's more like a myth to us, so feel free to move on with your plan after the video ends. Lastly, we hope you have great luck with your health and project. See you again soon.